Hello friends, I am Mayuri from We Teach Academy. This is our given example where we are given with the matrices A comma B and we have to show that the value of A plus B whole square is equal to A square plus B square. So in order to prove this one, we need to find the addition of matrices A plus B. So by adding two matrices, we get the elements in the form of 1 plus 1 which is 2. And here by adding minus 1 plus 1, we get 0. And then 2 plus 4 is 6. Minus 1 plus of minus 1 which in turn becomes minus 2. So this is the matrix for the addition A plus B. And now let us find the matrix A square. So A square can be written as A into A. So by multiplying the matrix A for two times, we get the value of A square. And in order to multiply, it satisfies the condition of two columns in first matrix is equal to two rows in the second matrix. And now let us begin with the multiplication. So by multiplying the first row with the first column, we get 1 into 1 which is 1 plus of minus 1 into 2 which is minus 2. And by multiplying the first row with the second column, we get 1 into minus 1 which is minus 1 plus of minus 1 into minus 1 which is plus 1. And then multiplying the second row, we get 2 into 1 which is 2 plus of 2 into minus 1 which is minus 2. And now here we get 2 into minus 1 which is minus 2 plus of minus 1 into minus 1 which is plus 1. And now performing the operations, here we get 1 minus 2 minus 1 and here we get 0 and then here also we get 0 and then the last element would be minus 1. So these are the values of A square and now let us find the matrix B square by just multiplying the matrix B for two times. And now let us perform the matrix multiplication. So here we get 1 into 1 which is 1 plus 1 into 4 which is 4. And then with the second column, you get 1 into 1, 1 plus 1 into minus 1, which is minus 1 again. And then in the next row, we get 4 into 1, which is 4 plus of minus 1 into 4, which is minus 4. And the last element would be 4 into 1, which is 4 plus of minus 1 into minus 1, which is plus 1. And then here by adding, we get 5. And the next element is 1 minus 1, which is 0. And in the next row, we get 0. And then the last element is 5. So this is the matrix for B square. And now let us find the value of RHS sign which is A square plus B square. So this is very easy to find as you already know the matrix A square. So let us write the matrix A square plus of the matrix B square which is 5, 0, 0, 5. And by adding both the matrices we get here minus 1 plus 5 which is 4. Then here corresponding elements 0 plus 0 is 0. And in the next row, we get 0 and then minus 1 plus 5 is 4 again. So this is the matrix for A square plus B square. And then coming to the right hand side, where we need to find the value of A plus B whole square. So we can easily find the value of A plus B whole square by just multiplying the matrix A plus B for two times. So here these are the matrices of A plus B. And now performing the multiplication, we get 2 into 2 which is 4 plus of 0 into 6 which in turn becomes 0 and then by multiplying with the second column we get 2 into 0 is 0 plus of 0 into minus 2 is 0 and then come into the next row which is 6 into 2 which is 12 plus of minus 2 into 6 which is minus 12 and then come into the last element which would be 6 into 0 which is 0 plus of minus 2 into minus 2 which is plus 4. And here, by performing the addition, we get 4 plus 0, which is 4. And then the next element is 0. And similarly, in the second row, we get 0. And here, the last element would be 4. So this is the matrix of A plus B whole square. By comparing both the matrices, we can say that the matrix A plus B whole square is equal to, to the matrix A square plus B square. So hence, we proved the condition. And now, for the same matrices A comma B, you try to prove the condition A square minus B square is equal to A plus B into A minus B and let me know whether it satisfies or not in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.